Hi, Ina here again. And look, Shemi brought over the cover she made for me. And it's just really amazing and cool. Uh, please look up her link below of how she made this. And also follow her second video in our collaboration. There are just so many colors and textures and details. I love the stencil she used in the inside. Of course, I have a pocket and looking at it, I'm of course thinking, well, what can I use it for? What style would fit? And I mean, the texture is just amazing. I wish you could touch it. Anyway, it really reminds me of my old hippie days. <laughs> so I think I'm going to just stay crazy colors all the way. This is all craft paper, and I'm just showing you some of the main elements I will be using to make the signatures. This craft paper, uh, I aligned it with another craft paper, and I also cut these little squares. I want to uh, make a little a place to maybe display photos, or glue some elements, or write, whatever. So I will be using these and I also have this nice rice paper and even though it is not the right size I think I can make it work so it will fit into my signature. I also have some magazine cutouts and well I'm gonna get started. Enjoy!
Well, we're just about done, so let's have one more look. This book turned out to be one full of memories for me. The little bell at the end, the beads, and this lovely yarn from India. And of course, no hippie would ever be without candles and feathers. <laughs> and my signature, I'm hoping to find lots more elements I could add to it. And um, there's a tiny little tuck spot right there. And of course, the little pocket on the bottom. And then there is my lovely rice paper. This one is from Nepal, and it gives me good memories as I lived there for many years. And again, more room to write or glue things or keep things. And of course, no hippie would be without the Zen box either. And some passport stamps. This one happens to be from Turkey and India, both countries I lived in before. So yeah, this was uh, really a lot of fun. And it, like always, it's not completely done yet. But I hope you enjoyed watching me. And bye-bye for now.